And he just flicked. I was like, oh my gosh, there goes a projector. Is that why I was on the ground for? That's why I was on the ground. I'm drunk and don't remember it. <laughs> Mickey would love it. She'll love it, hey. Cheers. That's a star one. Yeah. Wait. Oh no. <laughs> Thank you. You got the paint? Yeah, I feel like this is going to brighten it up heaps. I'm so excited. Hello guys, good morning! We are about to go head off to Bunnings. We found a few little projects around the house that we are wanting to do. Actually, Kerr, another thing, we still need to finish the fence outside my office. We'll do that, we'll do that another time. We've got a few painting jobs going on, guys. You might remember when we painted around the pool, Kurt always promised me that one day we would do this part of the fence outside my office. We're not doing that today, but I'm reminding you guys so we can hold him accountable to do that with me. Who remembers when we painted all this fence? That was a big job. We painted all down the back, all down the side here. It took us ages, hey, to fully finish it. Hello! Mm. Would you find mum and dad? I didn't. I walked everywhere and I couldn't find mum Oh, here's the story she's telling her. Was that a dream that you had? Um, yeah. So much better. So, our next projects that we're wanting to do. First is this study desk. I've wanted to paint this white since I can honestly remember. Number one reason, I don't know if you guys can see that, but the kids have drawn all over this when they were little. There's literally drawings all over it. So there's that. And then secondly, I don't know, I feel like just all white is just a vibe at the moment. I really like that really nice, neat, clean look. Also, it makes it stand out. And this isn't like a place that I want to stand out. Where everyone always throws everything to so where the school bags go, the spare books go. This is just always like the messy space of the house. Then the next place we are wanting to paint is this poster at the front of our house. I also would love to do the garage door and these slats here. Fun fact guys, when we were renovating our house, I actually really wanted to paint the entire house just white. We didn't end up doing it because painting the outside of the house costs a lot of money. But we thought what we might do, I've had like a chat about this heaps, is just paint all the timber white. So it's kind of more that lighter look. There's also no rush to get it done. I think what we might aim to try to do this week sometime is this post and these two things because they're just so overdue for a paint. I feel like especially these, like against now that we've got our white fence, it'll look so nice to be white. It'll really brighten it up because at the moment, I don't know, I feel like it'll just make them blend in a bit more. The reason we had these was because when the kids were young, we didn't have air conditioning and it was so hot in the front room. So to try to cool it down a little bit and also for privacy because we never ever had a front fence. So that's the reason why I built this. I actually wouldn't mind knocking these down but Kurt likes them, so compromise. <laughs> You ready? We're gonna go to the Yay! We made it! Do you remember what the paint color's called? Lex Concorda. Lex Concorda! Or is it, or is it three quarter? One eighth. No, it's Lex Concorda. Lex Concorda? Okay. I can really tell the white between the quarter and the half. Like that over there is probably a half, and this car is probably a quarter. Oh really? Mm. Just looking for a white. 
It's actually crazy how many different whites there are. I always get asked what colour our back fence was. Lexicon quarter. Lexicon quarter. White. White. What's our roof? Sand mist. No, it's not surf mist. Surf mist. <laughs> Let's do this. Give the kids a play on the playground in here. Just finished another book too, guys. Twisted Love. Literally read this in two days. Really liked it. Bit spicy, little twists and turns. Really liked it. Are you excited to go here? Hey, they've got the little trolleys here. So you can get yeah. your own little trolley to hold the paint, hey? What? You can use your own trolley to hold the paint, hey? Paint? Yeah. Got it? Now I'll go in for Regi. Regi would love it. She'll love it, hey? Do you want a trolley? Here you go. I'll push it. That's right here, Link. Just straight here. Brushes. Brushes. You're gonna get rollers too? Yeah, that's. We put these back, we put these back, we put these back. We don't need any of those, no, no, no. Ah! <laughs> Blinky, you got the paint? What colour do you think the paint is? White! Yeah! Also gonna get a couple pots while we're here. Yeah, for our I'm olive trees, here, yeah. yeah. Okay, you? Where's Reeves? Is she already up there? Hi, Reeves! Is that yummy? I got a bigger piece than me. <laughs> How is it, Link? As good as you remember? A sorghum is not coming here. No, we've got to come up short. Is that yummy? That one looks yum. like spicy stuff. Mm. I don't know. I need more. I need more. What is it? Oh. That's right. So cool. Cheers. That's a star one. Yeah. Yeah. Wait. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> nice one! Oh, no. That's okay. It's okay. Ricky, you've got a hot chocolate and me and Mum have coffee. I want over to run. Hello! Hi! Hello, 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 my sweet. Oh, hello. So these are the pots that we got, guys. I'm worried. I said to Kurt that I feel like they're too small, and then we went and saw his mum, and she was like, I think they're too small, because I'll show you what they need to fit in them. Kurt's mum and dad bought us two new olive um, trees for out here. So we had the middle one already, but then these two on the outside are new. So cool. And these trees are so hardy as well, which is awesome, because I'm not the greatest with plants. Yes, and darling? And I got a new... New work shirt from Grandma, hey? Looks so cool, and Riggy got one too. But I just don't know if they're gonna fit. It's gonna be a tight fit. Do you reckon they're gonna fit in the pots? The daddy got? There's one. Yeah, do you reckon they're gonna fit? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't know either. Oh. He might be able to make them fit. The goal for right here eventually, guys, is I want like a massive table, because it's such a big area here. Like a big one, so whenever we have all of our friends over, we can all sit at it. Should we see if these pots are gonna work? Yeah. Moment of truth. I really reckon they might not. He reckons they might not work. Look at Regi's work shirt. Yeah. I love it. I'm gonna go and get some pink one. Pink one. Pink one. <laughs> Perfect. Is it? Yeah, I've got to pull them out of that. Yeah. Oh yeah, actually it's pretty good. Yeah. I'm so good. <laughs> oh. I just need a break. <sighs> I'm really just so good at life. Are you? Yeah. Oh. Other people might say otherwise, but... <laughs> well, I did not think that that was going to fit. Well done, hon. I doubted you for a second there. Oh! Wow. You hosted a tree. Good girl. What, you don't get your face? What's your heart rings? <laughs> ah! <laughs> What are the trees? What are the trees? Nice. Oh, Reese! You got me that time! No! Look at her trying to get me. No. 
Hello guys, good morning. I've just gotten home from the gym. Kids are at daycare and school today and I said to Kurt, let's go on it. Let's just go spend an hour painting because I wanna get it done nice and early before the kids get home so they don't touch everything. I'm also, I was gonna start with the inside because it was raining, but now it's nice and fine. I think we're gonna start with the outside of the house. What are you doing? What, what are you doing? Me? Yeah. I'm getting myself ready for the camera. <laughs> he gets so distracted. We like go to do something. He's like, hmm. Then I was like, over like cleaning his shoes, shaving his beard. All right, I'm gonna get dressed into clothes that I don't mind getting paint on them. What? Nothing. <laughs> to wear? No. <laughs> Where did I go? What are you shaving? My face, babe. What's wrong with your face? Nothing at all wrong with my face, but. Did you need to shave it yesterday? Look at my head. Look. Oh you, sh oh, you shaved your chest yesterday. Yeah. I don't understand why you wouldn't do both at once. Because I don't like doing it. So I don't, I just like go, oh, I'm just going to do this and I'll do that. Okay. Next, so. okay. Who else does this for their partners all the time? Do you, look at your hair everywhere. Are you actually going to clean it properly? Save it. Oh, I'm so going to bite out of my throat. I hope you're going to clean this up, Mr. Darrell. I'm coming back to inspect. I've got something funny to tell you. So last night, you know how you had that weird thing? I don't think I've vlogged about it. They did in the middle of the night, randomly the other night. Like you did some weird thing and you're like, oh, just make sure you put that back in stock or whatever. So last night, no. you woke up and you were knocking our projector off your table. I'm like, what are you doing? You said, don't worry, I got it. <laughs> And you knocked onto the ground. Why am I doing that? Because I, I you know, every <laughs> night that I do it, yeah. I have really deep sleeps. Yeah, you go, don't worry, I got it. And you just flicked. I was like, oh my gosh, there goes a the projector. You said, why was on the ground this morning? That's why it was on the ground. I'm drunk and don't remember it. <laughs> and I can't find my tripod, guys, so I'm going to have to try to get um creative with my angles without one. <laughs> Think that I'm being that selfish right now. You said yourself you'd be breaking every vow. I can understand you're tired of this town, and I'm not saying that we have to settle down now. Just remember this we could have been stardust. Same world but without us Something made us, made us find each other out there Made us realize we're more than just stardust Ignore this fact if you must To do what your dreams are telling you to Here is how it's looking guys We're gonna do one more coat And then call it for today Because this has been an hour and we have to get some more work done um, and we're going to do the other post another day. So there's a second post there. We're also going to do this another day too. Are you going to do this another day or are you going to do this one now, the little poll? Oh, another day. Another day? Yeah. So we'll just finish this screen. Currently got one roller, guys. So we've been tag teaming between a roller and a paintbrush. But if you had a second roller... I really thought I was just be doing it by myself. That's why I bought one. Ah, oh, I helped you do the fence. Why would you think that? I can do the bottom part anyway, then you can do this whole, the top part. We also decided to do behind it as well, because then from this front room, hopefully it brightens it up a little bit more when you look out the window. See through here, yes, it's gonna brighten it up so much. So that's what it was like, it was quite dark, look out the window. Wow, I can't believe the difference this makes. Holy, that's so much better. Kurt, looks so much better from in here. <laughs> Yeah, that's crazy. Okay, this is like what I was hoping for and I said to Kurt, I feel like even the reflection of the white, it will like bounce in in the afternoon and just brighten it a bit. This end of the house is always a lot darker than the other areas of our house. So yeah, I feel like this is gonna brighten it up heaps. I'm so excited. I can't wait to do all the other bits and pieces, but I feel like you guys can tell how it looked before. Like it was all like this, like all brown. It's just gonna make it so much brighter. Love it. 
wish we did this ages ago. Also, I just feel like the outside of our house doesn't really match the inside of our house. When we did our renovations, we painted and like brightened everything up. It's very coastal. So yeah, I think by painting all the dark timber white, even though our house isn't exactly white, it's just gonna brighten it and give it more of that coastal feel. I'm still shook at how much that's gonna brighten that room up. And then yeah, this is Regan's room, which it's gonna make such a difference in here too. This is what it looks like from the outside of our house too now, guys. So it's the exact same color as our front fence. This is what it looked like before. This one's not done. Final coat done. It's looking good. Looking real good. Our biggest thing, guys, is we've told ourselves we don't want to have like a rush or a timeline on doing it all. We just want to like, you know, do a little bit of an hour here, an hour there. So I think to get all the bits and pieces that we want to get done is going to be a process. It's something it's probably going to, we're going to do like over the next couple months. But I'll keep updating you guys as we progress around the house and show you guys little befores and afters. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys soon.